So this is the all new fifth gen iPod Touch, bringing with it a completely redesigned thinner body and an assortment of colours to sink your teeth into. It's also traded in that tapered chrome backing of last year's model for a flat aluminium panel and has taken a cue from its smartphone sibling by chucking in a gorgeous 4 inch 16 by 9 retina display. And at 88 grams of a 6.1 millimeter thin waistline, the new iPod Touch is the lightest touch yet. And that anodized aluminium back makes it feel every bit like a premium machine, which means it's right up there with the new iPhone 5. Now the introduction of the dual core A5 chip is a huge bonus for the touch, with Apple claiming seven times faster graphics than before, which means it's even better for widescreen video, gaming and photo browsing. And like we've seen on the iPhone 5, the touch also rocks the lightning connector and round the back there's the improved 5 megapixel EyeSight camera with LED flash, autofocus and 1080p video recording. The 720p FaceTime HD front facing camera should prove handy as well. And because it's rocking iOS 6, that nifty panorama feature we saw on the iPhone 5 has been included, along with shared photo streams and maps with its awesome flyover mode, 3D views of particular cities. There is, of course, Passbook for quick access to third-party digital passes, coupons and tickets. And with its newfangled iPod Touch Loop, which comes in coordinated colours, it looks like Apple wants its new device to rival traditional point-and-shoot cams. Chuck in a whopping 40 hours of music playback and around 8 hours of video and you're looking at an impressive package that simply serves to make this the best iPod Touch ever. But of course, we'll be putting it through its paces in a full review very soon.